<laughs> Shit! Yes. I threw my shirt in the garbage. Right in there. Right in the garbage. Right in that garbage. I did! I did it! I sounded the test. Hello, welcome to another episode of Dragon Ball Z. I'm your host, Cactus Carrot Oh, that's not a bounce. Oh, oh, I'm forgetting my controls and shit. <laughs> At least you know how to go fast, I don't think. Can, why can't I bounce on the glass? Do you, do you have to manually bounce on the glass? As far as I can tell, no bounce is manual. The glass does not bounce. Pass it out. <laughs> it's a lunch game. It's the day two pack. Uh, so we're back with more Sunset Overdrive, me and Cameron. I can't remember what exactly I was doing other than the fact that I've now got a style meter and this game makes sense. This game now makes sense. Cameron is enjoying this game. I am enjoying this game. Which is very weird. And Bear Force 1 fired Bounce Explosion. Yeah. Alrighty. I think Bounce Explosion is whenever you <coughs> bounce on a car or something, it explodes. Just go to the amp chamber and drop off the ingredients to get Like, does it end. delete the bounce object no, as an explosion? It creates, like, it creates an explosion. Very okay. It doesn't delete it. It just... Busy balloons boom, boom. are filled with hydrogen. Smelly-ass shoes are a potent source of sulfur dioxide. Yes. Alrighty. Hamsters TP'd the city. Stupid, but works in our favor. Toilet paper is the perfect catalytic substrate. I don't believe you. No, it's a catalytic substrate. Are you ready for running around the entire city, parkouring everywhere, picking up loads and loads of trash? Yes! Yes, I am! Look, I've got icons on my mini-map now. Where's the amps? Amp. 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 Melee attacks, shoot out a fireball! Bouncing object, response explosion. Kills with this weapon have a chance to turn the... Killed enemy into a TN Teddy. So I'm guessing, uh, basically, one out of ten enemies you kill with it just explodes? Will explode. Big Get that. Mistake. What's that? Mistake. Looks like a time travel. Oh, traversal challenge two. Where's traversal, traversal challenge number one? <laughs> and we're trapped inside no, a walled up city full of zombies with no cover. And then the fourth one. security's doing a pretty good job. Fuck. I don't care what they're saying. I don't care. There's no time. <laughs> I could do this in my sleep. You can do this in your sleep, apparently. Here we go! Yeah! Oh, you were supposed to grind on the... On the left. Okay, so... I did go through it the first time, though, right? Yeah, I, saw, I swear I saw you do that. Yeah, I know. Uh, oh, that's it. Yep. Look at all that rank. Oh, but you didn't get gold because you suck. Oh, I don't. Uh, yeah, okay. So you didn't get the good stuff. You're gonna see a lot. Oh, you're gonna see a lot of that. Of your bad. Yeah. This is such a colorful ass game. It's actually kind of hard to see the collectibles, especially since I'm sprinting constantly. Well, that's an important thing. Guys, I'm just trying to climb up this wall. Uh, pardon me, excuse me. Pardon me, just J trying to climb a wall. Just. <laughs> Shut up. There you go. No! Yeah. <laughs> Good job. I got it. Just melee. Uh, no, I, I know. I. I no. Oh, I did it. Where am I? Okay, big. <laughs> Shh. It's fine. It's a learning curve. It's I did hadn't haven't played this in a very long time, you know. <laughs> Thrilling gameplay. Don't worry, guys. What are you doing, Cooper? My mic's not picking up. Your mic is not picking up. Yeah. Alrighty, stop the recording. What the fuck? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, well, I guess I'll just keep on trying to get better at this game again. Is yours working? Yeah. Hello and welcome back to another...
Hello and welcome back. You, I mean, welcome. This is the first ever recording of the second episode of Sunset Overdrive. Whee! Get that thing. Get that guy. Get him. What Get guy? The guy up there. There's a guy? Uh. Oh my god, I cannot keep up with this. What fucking guy? <laughs> there was, there's a floating blimp collectible guy Where? over there on the trains. On the trains? <laughs> no, it's okay. So down there? Yes. Dirty shoes. Oh, I, I see. Go play the game. Stop doing this. Stop playing the game. Oh, there's a person there. I'm here to save oh. you. Uh. <laughs> Let's light them on fire. Well, how do I save? I have no idea. I can't wait till you get a slam. Because amp. I do enjoy my slam. You do enjoy your slam. I always enjoy my slam when I go to Denny's. <laughs> do you get it? No. Okay. Dude. Am I just supposed to be shooting the guys? I guess dudes? so, for ten more seconds. Yeah. I'm starting to think <laughs> I'm a boring person. What? <laughs> <laughs> Me and you, Cameron, Yeah. play video games so differently. I remember back when I played this game, I never got off a rail and walked. Ever. He's making a plane. Doesn't that look like a reliable plane? <laughs> what do you think's gonna happen? What do you think's gonna happen? It's tower defense. Just in time, because it's so cool. Oh no. Oh no. You wrecked his plane. I feel nothing. I feel nothing, too. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Dad, who's not my real dad. Uh, don't know. Who cares about the multiplayer? Get the multiplayer out. Edit. Edit the multiplayer out. Do it. Get it out of here. Get the entirety of the multiplayer out of here. No one needs to see this. Was it good? No. <laughs> Whee! What? Bullshit. You must have to be in jump to do that. What was that, like, cranny in that? Hub? That was a hell of a cranny, is what that was. Yeah, what's that? It's a cranny. How do you do that? How do you get in there? <laughs> Flawless, you got it. You're a master at Sunset Overdrive, a release game for the Xbox Series X. Fuck! <laughs> Fuck! Who cares? Let's just do the objective. I want to know the cranny. Well, maybe it's on the other side of the building. That's not how I'm supposed to go around the corner. Oh, okay. that's your house. You can't Oh, that's my house? No. Maybe? It looked like the inside was modeled after the, that one cutscene that we saw that For one For some time. reason, it really reminds me of Spider-Man 2 on the original Xbox. Spider-Man 2? Is, yeah. That's a good thing. Yes, it's, uh, I'm pretty sure there was, like, one or two weird, like, missions where you can just see inside of a room from the outside, and you can just go in there, like, through a window, and it's incredibly awkward to actually get inside, you need to, like, crawl around Very it. specifically. Yeah. I think you go to, like, Mysterio's apartment or something. Talk to Flood. Oh, no, he's upset at you. Because you broke his plane that would have got him out of here because there's an invisible wall encasing the city. It's just like Cabin in the Woods. What? Bad, poorly written? Cabin in the Woods isn't poorly written. Oh. Uh. <laughs> it's a Joss Whedon. I, well, I have no idea. Oh, no, there's literally an or... invisible wall in Cabin in the Woods. Oh. 
That's like, cool. Yeah, like a guy jumps a motorcycle over a gorge to escape and hits an invisible wall and eats shit. <laughs> and this is in a movie. Yes. Hello and welcome back. So, that we had quite an adventure of an intermission. Yeah. We found out that the uh, audio for the game hadn't been recording. Yeah. And That's then great. I found out that Toblerones are not terrible, pretentious chocolate with a bunch of shit in them that ruins it. It's actually just chocolate with good stuff in it. Yeah. That I'm not even allergic to. Just chunky nougat. And then a child climbed on me, and then we played Starhawk. <laughs> and it turned out to be like a base building strategy game. With That's pretty cool good. Planes. With cool spaceship mechs. Gundams. And oh, oh, and then um we tested everything to make sure it was working, and now the sound quality is different. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I love that! Yeah, it's great. And we changed nothing. But anyway, here we are in Sunset, Sunset. 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 Finally doing episode two. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And then this is going to be oh, mid. On. And then this is going to be midway through the episode, so people don't understand. Yes. <laughs> no, they'll understand because the first ten minutes of the episode will have no fucking audio for the game. <laughs> and it's going to be dumb meme songs or something. <laughs> it's going to be dumb. Oh, go do the objective. Go do the thing you're. The supposed objective to do. is very far away, Cooper. I can't wait for the awkward, weird transitions of you being on the opposite side of the map. Every ten minutes. <laughs> That's gonna be great. Oh man. Look at you go. Apparently Cameron doesn't want to do a full playthrough of this. What a lame -o. Uh I'm I may yet be convinced. You may yet be convinced. Let us know in the comments. Yeah. Because I like this game. And I would love to see Cameron play it fully. I mean my knowledge of this game, uh, not a lot changes gameplay wise, like you're doing a lot of the same stuff throughout the entire game. But I'll be doing it with more fun. With more fun gimmicks. Yeah. Yeah, more fun gimmick weapons and abilities. And I will never once have an emotion while playing it. And <laughs> I will not <laughs> once have an emotion. <laughs> Can you grind on barbed wire? I'm trying really hard. You rolled on it. We can play the co-op mode. We can play the- but I ne I'll need to download it on the other Xbox. Yeah. You want me to do that? No. <laughs> you, you said it was bad. It's just- it's- What? Uh, oh, that was a load screen. He didn't have an icon dealy thing on his head, so am I supposed to chase him? I remember this mission. Okay, scary I remember this mission. I think I played through the campaign of the first one like four or three different times. The first one what? Oh my Is god. Is this a sequel? No. What? What's going- the, what, the What's the, happening to you? In my mind, I was like my, the first profile, the first account. Not the first game. Bip, bip, bip. Hey Cameron. Yeah. Have you gotten the obvious joke yet that that shotgun's a dick? Yes! It's called the compensator! <laughs> it's got balls! So, during our massive intermission, Cameron was running around, and I was about to say something that I didn't want to say because there was a child was present. Are you like a, superhero? a child but, that was actively climbing on top of my head. <laughs> but when you, when you take out the shotgun, your guy cocks it. And I was like... Well, uh, good luck, kid. Cool. And, Sam, but, but um, you anyway, all, you cock the shotgun. You. He cocks the yeah. shotgun, and I was about to say, to why do you cock the shotgun? But then I realized why he cocks the shotgun. Wait, wait. Because it's a cock. Oh, this is gonna be perfect. Does it not, is it not a pump action? It's not a, fire? it's a blunderbuss. The balls jiggle, too. I hear the sound, but he doesn't actually there do it. When you were doing the idle animation stuff, he did it. Oh, I see. Yeah. Haven't you ever watched a movie where a guy pump action cocks an automatic weapon? Yes. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's so dumb. It's just how it goes. Oh man, what is that thing? 
Dodge roll. <laughs> Freaking get him. These guys. These guys are the guys that they make to make it so that you don't stay on the same thing over and over again because those guys will shoot you. Ah, so, so you like can't just go back and forth on one On rail. a railing, yeah, because those guys will get you. I'm pretty sure that's their purpose because you don't want to go back towards where they shot and also I think they it's will like, lead their shot. It's been like two hours since I had my hands on, so I'm basically fresh again. <laughs> uh, there we go. Yeah, speed button. You know what's weird? Microsoft Studios makes good games. No one ever plays them because they're on Xbox. No one ever plays them, but they do make good games. Like, most of the Microsoft Studios games are pretty good. Or pretty cool. Oh, yay. You're leaving me behind? No, I'd just like to hear you scream like a girl. You're my hero! I... so many feelings. You like this quirky dialogue? No! Why not? <laughs> this game was advertised as being the hip happening game, by the way. Like... Oh, I believe you. Yeah. You're a kid, you'll love this game. It's got dicks and farts and swearing. That one guy says fuck! Yeah, exactly. When I first started this game, you know the plane you were building with that stupid guy that sucks? When I first started this game, I was all... I, I listened... Right. I, need to re I need to redirect my brain. I need to start playing this game. Not like a third-person shooter? And no, like I started it's... playing it like Bright Memory. <laughs> I'm just like, okay. You're shooting, them while, you're shooting them while backing up. But, um... When I first started this game... I thought that that plane was so redundant and pointless because I was paying attention and listening to the lore. And lore? Yeah, and the lore, like, Fizco made these guys on purpose, I'm pretty sure, with their new drink. And Fizco quarantined the place with the invisible wall security stuff. So I'm like, okay, the guy wants to use a plane to get out of a invisible wall dome. Are you kidding me? Because I was like you at the beginning, I just went, an open world game, let's run around and do everything before I do any main missions. Yeah. And so I did, and I discovered the invisible wall, and I was all, well... Well, maybe he doesn't know about it. Yeah, but that's dumb. Yeah, because you could just tell him. Yeah. I really hope there's a dramatic scene later on when you realize there's an invisible wall around. I think he crashes the plane you make for him. Into, into it. It's just like Cabin in the Woods. <laughs> you know, it might be a direct reference I that I never going, got. Oh, I'm supposed to be going somewhere. I'll see if I can get the train started. You check the train for supplies. And keep the OD off me. Keep the, the OD off me. Now you think it would stand for overdosed or something. No, it's overdrive. It stands for overdrive. Oh, huh. Okay, see what I can put together. <gasps> I guess this was heading to Toys for Terrorists? Haha, uh, <laughs> new gun. Some of this. Those? Cute and explodey. But chocolate and peanut butter. You got your rocket launcher. I'm tired of exploding teddy bears. Why? <laughs> because every single game that's a quirky game has fucking exploding teddy bears. You know. They're not quirky anymore, they're expected. Yeah, I I see that. I 100% get where you're coming from. It did after a bit, but I, you might have taken minimal damage from it. Did they just? It only goes off when it hits an enemy. Wait, so you could place them as traps? Those are traps. Yeah, it only goes off when it hits an enemy. Or you could like bounce them off walls and stuff. That's kind of cool, I guess. I guess. <laughs> I. Well, I don't really see the application of it. It doesn't seem that useful that they bounce, you know? It's just kind of like a neat little detail that they made it I so need they're to get not. get higher up. Shit's going bad. Wait, are we done? Okay, I got yep. It. Oh. Ride that train. Ride that train. It's just like infamous.
<laughs> he misses boring. You like that line. You laugh. Cameron yeah. laughed at the dumb video game, guys. I laughed at the dumb video game. <laughs> Okay. If only I had driven a slow moving object into that guy when I was fighting him in that tower defense. Tower defense sequence. I saved us. I saved us. Come on, our safe house is just down the street. Do you like how your super cool parkour man and this guy's nerd uh, fanboy over you? Not really. I don't like it. <laughs> that trope is played out in a lot of things. Sam, what were you doing at that factory all by yourself? <sighs> Dude, I want you, know, you to get to the stuff I used so I can nostalgia all over it. Because <laughs> I'm remembering the guns, and I think I used the shotgun forever because it's really good. It's really good. It's unreasonably good compared to the disc launcher and the revolver. Yeah, but um, there are a butt ton of other weapons that I used as well. I remember something that shocked people. That wasn't the disc launcher. Well, it's not that it, the disc launcher shocks people, it's that that's what I've got the amp on. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this thing was specifically shocked by itself. Yeah, get him. Get on with it. Let's end. Edit. Skip the dialogue. Who cares? Do we care? I don't. I want you to meet my new friend. Shut up, Sam. You suck at friends, Sam. They're not You suck at you friends. You suck at friends. They don't know how to deal with a mutant apocalypse. I know how to make them come around. If Seriously. Get them to listen to me. Maybe you can help me help them. You want me to be your life coach? Yes. What should I do first, coach? Step one, never call me coach again. Step two, never do that again. Step three, let's see what your friends need to get upright and start working on that propeller. The apocalypse is boring, seriously. I feel nothing, but I've got a blazer. <laughs> Are you gonna put it on? Uh. My friend Calissa's there selling clothes and stuff. Hey! You hey, you could buy clothing now. Alrighty. From Feather Shoulders, Bird Lady. You never know what's gonna fit. I love Feather Until Shoulders, it Bird on. Lady. It's just like Dio's outfit in uh, Jojo Part 1 when he uh, turns that guy into a vampire. He's got the feather shoulders. Edited for Spree of Shop. Just punk jeans. I don't have chains. Dude, I used to wear a chain. You did? Yeah. Did you? Were you cool? It was a bike chain. That's really cool. I think I still have it. You should show me your chain. Yeah. <laughs> uh, such on that long ass was. clown feet. Look at that. <laughs> what do you mean? Your feet are like that. Look at my my feet, feet are much smaller than yours. No, they're not. They are. No, they're not. Yes, they are. No, we just measured. Frick you. <laughs> we both just put our feet together. Both. Both. Buy a new melee. What about? Buy a new melee. What about a. Mm. Get a new me. Wow. Get a baseball bat for $10,000. Crowbars are cooler. Agree to disagree. I don't think baseball bats are super cool, but I don't think crowbars are cool at all. I'd much prefer. How do you? Am I gonna drag myself underneath the the wires with a baseball bat? Oh my god! You're right. Cause if he just still has the crowbar, I'm gonna switch back. Cause that would annoy the fuck out of me. Yeah. He probably does still use the crowbar for the wire dragon. Don't look at the camera and pause the. Oh my god. But this game is meta. There's a bottling plant a few blocks away. If you can bring back a couple bottles for him. Wait a sec. You're telling me that the only thing that will make this guy get off his ass is some brand name bottled water? You yes. don't know him like I do. Because they're all preppy rich like kids. Trust me. Once we give him what he wants, he'll help make your propeller. Do you like them? What no! what cool characters? What very interesting cool characters those are. Oh man, I don't have those baggy ass pants anymore. I feel so free. 
What? Isn't shouldn't that be the opposite? You wish I was your mother. No. What are you talking about? I feel weighed down. Dude, I dude like I don't I will not wear the ultra baggy that's like four times the width of my legs. I will not wear the skinny jeans. I need something that gives me like half centimeter radius around my entire leg at all times. Mm. Even this would be a little tight for my butt. <laughs> How do I switch back my melee weapon? Or do I need to go back to the fender? You didn't oh, buy yeah. the the bat, did you? Yeah, I did. You did? Yeah. Oh, you did. Who cares? Go. Uh, but look at this! No! no. Look! Yeah! Bullshit. It's great. You should use the baseball bat for that. It would make sense. Yes, I yeah. prefer that. <laughs> hey, it's Do Head Jack. Yeah! Disgusting! Beautiful. Contamination detected. Facility offline. Awaiting activation of emergency flush system. Time to flush this factory sized toilet. Emergency flush system activated. Wow. Just kidding. Obstruction detected. Do you like how it said just kidding? No. Release safety valves to prevent complete and Do you like how you have to go up there and grand grand slam that? Oh no. There were a bunch of dudes there. I would have been impressed if they if the AI had activated and there were actually a bunch of dudes to deal with. <laughs> Rather than just set piece yeah well no that would have been a set piece but like that was just an effect yeah isn't this so fun go here hold Y go here hold Y watch well, mini cutscene you still need to uh, press the button at the right times it's like a, it's like thumper it's like thumper thumper what's thumper it's, I've the got bambi it the, I've got it on the switch the bambi what from Bambi. No, not the rabbit. The video game. Thumper. Like rhythm it. violence. Rhythm violence? Yeah. Oh, they call it a violent rhythm game. There's there's a game that like Kingdom Hearts. There's a game that I just uh read about on the Game Pass on Xbox. It's called Haven. And it's a spiritual game about uh it's a it's a it's a rpg about love and friendship and the ratings like the descriptive things for this game were nudity sexual content violence and drug use what what Okay, start over from the beginning on that. <laughs> I, I was checked out until you started saying nudity and drug use. There's a game called Haven on the Game Pass that I was reading, and it's a game about love and friendship. All right. But then it's rating whatever they call it. It's X, descriptor. Adults only. Yeah, nudity, sexual content, use of drugs, and swearing. And it's like, um... What? I've watched I've watched lots of movies like that. <laughs> Where it's like this Where emotional the, roller coaster. Okay, I need to get on a thing. I need to yes, hello. You have acquired being on thing. Maybe use your stun gun or your fire gun. Get that proc that. Health up. Alpha. Yeah, there you go. You stunned him. Yeah, stunned him. Boosh, boosh. That fire effect is real good. I kind of like it. Did you see how I figured out how you beat big enemies that keep on swinging at you? Hmm. You just keep on bouncing on one thing and then just keep on shooting them? <laughs> because you can actually aim at them? Maybe if I turned up my sensitivity, it would be easier to aim at people Please. while actually Stop. playing the game. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Did I, am I going the wrong way entirely? Do you love how- Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs>
questions if he's going the wrong way. Mission failed. Immediately. Immediate failure of mission. But, um... Oh, what was I gonna say? Do you love how this guy wants premium bottled water and you go to the plant and it's just disgusting poop water everywhere? Even in the pipes? Yeah. Like, they're not even animated. Yeah, not really. It was a fun surprise the first time. <laughs> Available for delivery. My work here is done. I'm out, bitches. Do you like it? No! Stop it! <laughs> Why don't you like it? Better get this back to what's his face. Get ready for this. The second you open that door, I was like, oh, that's right. The you're carrying stuff escort missions. Plural. Like, because it's basically an escort mission, because you cannot damage the product, you can't really fight back. I can roll into them really good, though. Oh! Oh, wow. Those guys lead you. Yeah, those those guys try to get you. And I guess wow, I can't God. hang. Oh, I can hang. <laughs> Fuck! I wonder if you could get, get under that stuff. They really want that water. Cause that makes sense. You did it! I mean, not that I had any doubt that you would. Wait here. Hey Dirk, I got something I think you might like. Sick. Sick. Ah, oh, fuck, that's good. Oh god. Purest water on earth. Yeah. Thanks, Sam, you rock. Did you like that? No. Pa pause for pause for funny joke. He said purest water on earth and then it said may contain every chemical on the planet. Dirt will certainly help, but we need to get a couple other people on board. Yeah. Do you like it? How is that comfortable? I like this game when I'm not playing missions. 